Hey, what's up guys, gals? Buddy Boom here. And it is November 5th, 2018. I can't believe this year is almost over. All right, so today I am making this video about Facebook and how to set your profile look for success and to reach the, the best engagement on your Facebook profile. All right, so if you're an online marketer or a network marketer, and you do a lot of your marketing through Facebook, then you are going to want to um, set your Facebook profile up for success for the most engagement so you can reach out to the masses. You want everybody to be able to see what you're posting. You want to be able to get in, into contact engagement with the, the most people possible so one of the first things that you're going to want to do is with your picture your little picture that picture here you're going to want to post a picture or upload a picture of yourself something that's going to be personalized to you so people know who you are get a sense of who you are and what kind of person that you are so it has to it needs to be a good picture uh, possibly a picture of you smiling or just a picture of you in general so people can get a feel of you from your profile and you know feel comfortable with being on your profile so you want them to be able to come back and you want to post a lot of value and good content on your Facebook profile and then your background picture here you're gonna want to post I mean you can post a picture of a car or a house or something that inspires you you know so right, like right here I have a picture of um, a stack of money that I had. I had like three or four thousand dollars, and I, I just, you know, I put a text in there. You will wish you started today, and I put B boom, and I have a sticky note on top of the money, so people know that that's my money and it's not big money, and it's something that inspires me on a daily basis, you know, to to keep doing what I'm doing, to engage on Facebook and reach out to people on Facebook. And, you know, this, this profile is personalized to me, to Buddy Boom. You don't want to post, a, you know, post, a, upload pictures of your company that you're promoting or the compensation plan or the company logos or anything like that. You want to be able to, in, you know, brand your own name, brand your own company. So, as much as, as excited as you are about whatever opportunity that you're in, if you're online marketing or network marketing, please refrain from um, uploading pictures of your company or the company logo or anything like that, compensation plan or anything like that. You want to personalize your profile to you. And under my name here, I have like a little... Um, inspirational quote success comes from failure not from people telling you it can't be done and in about me I put self-employed um, chief security officer former security officer and I we want to post you know what you have done in the past because you know it could reach out to other security guards or other people that work in your field you know, they say, hey, he's, this guy's a security guard and he works from home, he can do it. Maybe I could give it a shot. So this is why you want to, um, in the about you field on this Facebook profile, you want to fill all these blanks in because you want to reach out to much, as much as people as you possibly can. Reach out to the masses. You want people to know about you, know where you're from, you know, kind of know your status because you reach out to everybody on the pictures down here I have this follow me picture so people look at come to my profile they you know I want them to follow me I have my YouTube uh, picture here with the YouTube link because I have important content on my YouTube that I do training on that's what I'm going to put this video on also and I have some inspirational quotes one thing that you want to do with your settings is you want to have all your settings set to public. 
so everybody can see the post that you're making. You don't want to have anything that you have on there private because you want to reach out to everybody. Facebook has billions of people on there. You could reach out to everybody possible in the world. If you have an international business, it's important that you set all your settings to public. Now, the only settings that you're gonna have hidden is your friends. You're not gonna show people how many friends you have because if you're just starting and you only have, you know, 50 friends or 100 friends, they're gonna they're gonna look at your profile and think that you're you don't have a social media following or a presence. So you want to set your friends. You want to hide the friends on there. And about your posts that you make on your social media, you want to refrain from posting about problems or issues or profanity or porno or anything like that. You want to put positive stuff only on your profile. New lifestyle. Make people curious about what you're doing. So you want to post pictures of family. You know, post pictures of events, like if you go to the beach or your whatever you're doing family-wise. You want to you want to just um, document that. And put it on your timeline. Show people that you're you're living a good life and you're happy. And I know life isn't all you know all peaches and creams, and then life isn't always positive. But you want to give out that positive vibe because if you're just a negative Nancy and you're posting about crap that you know all the problems that you're having in your life you're going to you're going to repel people away from you so you want to post stuff that's going to help people want to engage with you you know like and for instance the fill in the blanks type of posts that make people want to answer that like you know like when I turn 30 or turn 40, I want to accomplish blank. And you'll be surprised how many people want to engage and do the fill in the blanks. Also like jokes, the one-liners, people like to interact with these one-liners also. So you just wanna post positive stuff on your timeline. You want people to engage with you. You want people to interact with you you want people to like and comment what you do and you know feel good about being on your on your timeline you want them to feel like they know you so I myself I'm trying to get more comfortable with doing live videos again I was doing live videos I did a 30-day challenge and I did had a lot of people that were interacting with what I was doing on my live videos and so do lives and do fill in the blanks and don't just look, sound like a broken or look like a broken record and just post about your business all the time or put your your business links out there or put your pictures of your business logo. You want to create curiosity with people. You can put something like, I'm ready to help 10 people build their online empire. Leave a comment below. You want them to be curious about what you're doing online. If you just post your, your company logo your company link then people can just simply go to Google and search for the business that you're in and they're going to see the they're gonna see the person that has the most engagement with this business and they're gonna join him or her and you're you're gonna lose out you're gonna lose out on you know a downline person a referral because you just you basically just committed suicide with them um, with your online business and posting your link and your logos on there. So you just want, you want to create curiosity instead of posting about your business all the time. And you just, you want to show them your lifestyle, set all your settings to public, put attractive pictures, inspirational quotes. You can go to Google and search for inspirational quote images and download those. And, you know, post those on a daily basis. Don't post about life problems. I mean, we're all human. So, I mean, just don't go online just to pitch around and, you know, because that's what, you know, 90, 95% of the people do is just go on Facebook just to bitch and moan around and talk about their problems. 
So you want to stick out from the rest is what you want to do. And this is setting up your Facebook profile for success. Don't put company logos. Set your settings to public so everybody could see your posts. Hide your friends about you. You want people to know about you. And when posting about your business, create curiosity. You want to create curiosity so people want to know more. And by them wanting to finding out more, they have to comment or contact you. But I hope this information was helpful to you guys. You know, if you want to you want to find out more about what I'm doing online, then just um, simply comment. I'm going to have my Facebook link at the bottom. So if you want to join me on Facebook, become friends with me, then feel free to click that link at the bottom. You know, and I will like I will gladly accept. And just tell me that you you watch the video and what else what else am I missing out on here about setting up your profile for success success okay just um create curiosity engage when you're engaging with other other people you want to go on your friends list on a daily basis and comment on their timeline comment and like their posts share some of their good posts inspirational posts and focus on doing that on a daily basis and you'll notice if you focus 30 minutes a day on liking and commenting on other friends comments and stuff and other things that you'll start creating more engagement on your own timeline and another thing is you know, leave emojis in their comments. Don't just comment, leave emojis because you want your comment to stick out more than anybody else's. So I hope this, con I hope this content was valuable to you. If this was valuable, hit that like button. Don't forget to su subscribe to my channel. And I want to create more videos that will help people out here how to start engaging on Facebook with your online or network marketing business. And if you want to find out more about what I'm doing, how you can start getting $500 paydays and get multiple streams of income, then just leave a comment down below and I'll, I'll give you more information. I'll interact with you, engage with you and give you some details about what I'm doing online here. So again, I hope this information was valuable. Hit that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button. And if you found some value in this, just let me know your thoughts. All right, guys. I wish you a good one. November 5th, 2018. This is Buddy, and I will see you on the next video. All right, guys and gals. Peace out. Much love.